Hey, what's up guys? Let's start by making some elephant toothpaste. First of all, we need to pour hydrogen peroxide inside of this cup. We will try to create a chemical reaction by pouring powder simultaneously into these four cups. We will also add mentos so that the reaction gets bigger. Now let's add some color. Let's start the experiment. I hope you guys have enjoyed, now let's watch it from another angle. That was nice, it's actually looking like toothpaste. Here I have a bottle of Pepsi and potassium permanganate. I heard that if you pour potassium permanganate inside of the Pepsi the color turned purple and there's a chemical reaction let's try now let's watch it in slow motion If any of you know why the Pepsi turned purple, let's write it in the comment below, I will be interested to know why. Let's start the main experiment with Coke Zero and Lava. We will begin by pouring Coke Zero inside of this bottle of glass. I already did an experiment using regular Coca-Cola, lava and mentos inside of a bottle of glass. I am curious to see if Coke Zero can give us a different reaction knowing that there is no sugar inside. We will now start the foundry. We have aluminium and copper. I will first pour some aluminium inside of the foundry and after we will add copper. It will take about 20 to 30 minutes to melt the metal in lava, knowing that the aluminium melts at 608 degrees Celsius. time that we wait for the lava to be ready, we will pour baking soda inside of this container. I have a couple of mentos that we will also add inside of the container. 
we will throw it on the Coke Zero at the same time that we put lava. Smoke is still escaping from the sand, it looked like a volcano. I will now use this tower that I made with pipe to make an experiment. I have this pipe to which I ink this device that will serve to retain a liquid. can see it will be fixed on the tower. Now we will add balloons. We will now add Coke Zero inside and we will mix it with hydrogen peroxide. Let's turn on the device. Let's add some Mentos inside of this bottle of Pepsi. Today is a very hot day so it might get interesting, knowing that the Mentos will dissolve faster. For the last experiment, I decided to pour lava directly into inside of a 2 liter of Coca-Cola.
I hope you guys have enjoyed all of those experiments. Don't forget to subscribe and write us in the comment below which experiment you would like us to do next. Have a nice day.